Hey boys, it's Arm None. Today we're going to be customizing the Chevelle Fugitive in Grand Theft Auto Online. Now I'm customizing this car for a specific video that I am working on in the future. I have made mention of it before. You guys can make your guesses in the comments below if you would like to, or you can just wait. Anyway guys, we're going to be hopping into the mod shop and getting customizing. Alright guys, so starting off, we are going to go all the way up on the armor with this car. The brakes as well for sure. The engine all the way up as well. For the horn, we are going to be putting a certain horn on this car. For the lights, we are going to go xenon, of course. For the plate, we are going to go yellow and black. Now for the respray on this car, I have an idea of what I want to go for, and that is going to be like a darker sort of blue color. Probably like galaxy blue. I feel like galaxy blue is actually a really good look for this car, and I feel like, I don't know, I feel like I've never personally customized it like this, and I feel like I've never seen anyone else customize it like this. So let's go for galaxy blue. Now for the transmission, we will go all the way up on that. For the turbo, we will go all the way up on that as well. Now for the wheels on this thing, I have a specific sort of idea for what I want to do with them. However, I almost like the stock rims. I'm really not sure, but I feel like I almost want to keep the stock rims. So I think we're actually going to do that. Of course, we are going to put on bulletproof tires. And last but not least, we are going to tint the windows on this thing all the way out. This car, honestly, I feel like is a pretty underrated car in Grand Theft Auto Online. I feel like it's a really good looking car. Anyway, let's take it outside. We're going to do a sound test and a review. Honestly, this car actually sounds really good. As far as like a vehicle that you can just get off the street, this thing sounds like crazy. It's It's got a really, really nice sort of tone to it. It definitely sounds like it has a V8, at least in my opinion. You guys can let me know what you think in the comments down below, but I do think that this thing probably has a V8. It kind of reminds me of a Pontiac, I want to say a G8. I could be wrong. I think that the Pontiac G8 is basically the Pontiac version of the Chevrolet SS. I think that's just what it's called. I don't think it's like an Impala SS or anything like that. I think it's literally just called the Chevy Super Sport. And I think that's what this car is based off. If I could be wrong, let me know if you guys have any better guesses or if you really know what this thing is actually based off of. Uh, let me know in the comments down below. Now, the Chevelle Fugitive is a car that goes for $24,000 on Southern San Andreas Super Autos. So I'm not honestly expecting the greatest performance out of this thing. However, with the turbo, the transmission, and the engine upgrades, this thing is actually pretty quick. Now, definitely it's not gonna win you any races. There are gonna be cars that are gonna be way faster in this thing's category. I believe this is either a sedan or a coupe, even though it's, you know, four door, but anyway. I'm not super impressed with the speed. You know, the speed is good, it's, it's fine, it's fast enough. The handling of this vehicle is very, very impressive. I think that this is, I think this might be one of the best handling cars that you can get for free off of the streets in Grand Theft Auto Online. I'm gonna go ahead and say this is top five cars that you can actually get off the street and put in your garage for free. I'm gonna go ahead and say this is top five in the entire game as far as handling goes. If not top five, then definitely within the top 10. This thing is actually very, very impressive. If it had a suspension option, it would be even better because I feel like the suspension would really help this car however it's it's really good it's really good i'm actually very impressed with the handling of this thing i've actually always been a fan of the chevelle fugitive i've actually owned several of these in the past throughout grand theft auto online i don't really know what happens to them i've probably sold them for one reason or another but man the chevelle fugitive is actually a car that i feel like everyone overlooks but is actually a pretty cool vehicle sounds really good handles really well isn't that slow and it looks pretty cool man i don't know this car is honestly pretty solid i would recommend checking this thing out if you guys have not before the fugitive is definitely a car that i would suggest picking up especially if you're newer to grand theft auto online or if you just want a subtle car to drive around in that's you know kind of chill chevelle fugitive baby this thing's pretty wicked anyway guys i think that is pretty much it for the customization and the review on the chevelle fugitive if you guys enjoyed this video leave a like if not dislike subscribe if you guys are new and i will see you all in the next video until then take care peace